that. Alright, what about over here? Windows can probably be broken and easy. Able to bust through that. Or not. Uh, one more? Be able nope. To bust through that. <sighs> well, can... Is the doggy door barred? Talk to Clementine. Will we be inside soon? Yeah, not much longer now. I hope so. It's getting cold out here. Anything we can do here? No. I'm a little bit unsure as to how I should proceed. Let's look at the doghouse again, but we don't have a shovel option for it, so that won't really do much. I'll talk to them again just to be sure there's no more dialogue. Not great, so long as we're stuck out here. Will you please go figure out a way to get us inside? How about instead of standing around, you help assess the perimeter? That could actually help us. Hmm. What am I missing? Did I examine the pet door already? What's this? Obviously not. Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. I tried it already. That's locked too. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I have. My neighbor had one just like that. It's it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip oh, in it, that's so just the sick. door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Dig up the dog. Shit. And, uh, Every day's a school day. Well, at least we know what to do. All right. So, where's the dog? You can only wonder. I love how they just give us like that perfect view of Lee turning directly at the mound. In case you had no idea already. Hey, be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be, you know what I mean? No, I hadn't thought about that in a world of zombies. Clementine, please step back slightly. What's buried down there? God. Is there a collar? Uh. Whatever it is, it's been here a while. You, I can smell it from here. Gross. Clementine, honey, come sit with me and Omid. Let Lee work. I'm not gonna lie, I can't really imagine Clementine not wearing that hoodie now. Even though I know it was a really questionable. Oh man, oh, that's God, just. Oh God, smell. Uh Oh my uh Must have belonged to someone. I guess we have to pick it up. Oh, this is strong. Gonna get infected by who knows get what. Off. Oh Okay, that is not cool. Why? Are you okay? I'm fine, honey. It's just the smell. Are you sure you're- I said I'm fine, okay? That is just wrong. Uh, should we bury it? Like, you think the smell could attract zombies? But they wouldn't eat something that's already all dead and rotten. They like flesh, brains. Uh. Here goes nothing. Clementine, here, come wear this collar. Yes! God damn! That was a joke. Don't get mad at me. Yay! You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. What? Get back. Whatever you're gonna get do, back. do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. You can't. I can already Be careful, tell. Man. Yeah, you won't reach. <clears throat> There's only one way. It's no good. I can't get it. It's the way that yeah, we always seem to have try. to do. I think I can. I knew it. Clementine, you should probably... Oh my god. Clem, what do you see in there? Oh my... Why do you have to do that, Clementine? Why do you have to do that? Ta-da! Good work, Clem. But don't go shooting off like that without asking first, okay? I was just trying to help. I know, and you did good. You just had me worried there for a minute. Can we maybe have this conversation inside? She just like took off into it like a dog. Like it was scary. Like one second, Kenny is about to reach his arm, or not Kenny, Ben's about okay to reach his here. arm up. Everybody in. In the next second, all I see is like the bottoms of her shoes. What if there had been a zombie? I couldn't have done anything to help her. Omid started to have a seizure there. 
I'm just kidding. It was just frame rate. What was that on the ground? Huh. Sorry, sorry. No, it's okay. I'm good. I feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, babe. Aww. So, when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? Uh... Well? I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? Because it stops How our progress. She just said that. In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least the dead don't play games with you. Whoever it was, seems like they're following us. And I don't like being followed. All the more reason to get on a damn boat where we can't be followed. I'm not going back out there anytime soon. Omid needs to if rest. If we're on a boat, we're not gonna have access to really anything. We need to make sure Chuck is okay. Once it's quieted down outside, we'll all head towards the river. See if we can find him. Deal? Suit yourselves, but I'm not gonna wait around too long for someone else to grab up those boats. That's our ticket out of here. Place seems secure, at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. <sighs> All right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door, understand? Okay. I'd feel safer if I just checked the entire house, you know. Is there anything I can do? Thanks, I got it. Hang out with Chris and Omid until I get back, okay? I probably Lee? should have had her come with I'm me. I'm sorry. What for? Going through the door like that without checking first? I guess that was pretty dumb, huh? Just, ask just not me first excited. The next time you're gonna outsmart all the grown-ups, okay? Okay. Okay. Let's start rifling through things, see what we can find. All empty. Hmm, not a big surprise, but we can always hope. No water. Nothing. Water's off. Nothing in there. Could we use the bag? Hope we never get desperate enough for food that this starts looking appetizing. I'm not that hungry. Besides, I need to finish checking the downstairs. I get the feeling we might need that bag for something since we're able to pick it up. I guess it's more... We'll wait and see what we find first. No power. No power. Hmm. Walter. <sighs> All cleaned out. I'm not thinking we're gonna really find anything. Let's see. There's the backyard door we came from. Let's check this grandfather clock. Must have stopped working a while ago. What about that bottom compartment area? Bottle of whiskey? Whoever cleared this place out left behind two bottles of whiskey. Looks like someone didn't have their priorities straight. <laughs> wow. How's it coming? Alright, so I guess we'll take these in case we Probably run back. Probably not the best idea right now. I need to stay frosty. I'm not gonna drink it. I'm gonna pick it up for Chuck. But okay. CDC. Looks expensive and heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. Alright, looks like the rest of that room is off limits. Before we go through the door, let's... Just do a good sweep of everything here. 
Not exactly my style. What is this? A smashed photo and the photo is taken? Alright, let's see what's through here. Carefully. Carefully. Jesus! Ah! What? What happened? It's nothing. Just, uh, nothing. Huh. Alright, so I'm going to take it that that's a closet. It's empty except for that room. We don't need to go upstairs yet. We still have more rooms to check. Let's see what Clementine has to say. Holding up okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? Not yet. No, but I'll take care of it. What about you guys over here? Hey, guys. How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet. Nothing so at far, all. so good. What do you guys think about this plan at Kinney's? The guy's losing it. Look, Lee, I know he's your friend and all, but you need to be careful. That man is on the edge, and I don't know if I want to be around when he goes over it. Kenny's solid. He's just been through a lot, that's all. I hope you're right. For all our sakes. Check on his leg. How's that couch treating you, Omi? Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. I feel you. I don't think he's doing too great. I think he's getting pretty close to maybe not being able to walk. Finding this house was a hell of a stroke of luck. I like it a lot better when we know for sure it's safe. I'll make sure. But right now it feels like just the break we needed. Maybe our luck's starting to turn Wait. around. I'd like to believe that. Really, I would. Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. We need to pour the alcohol on his wounds so it's not infected. Because infection is what will cause him to seize up and not be able to walk and cut off the leg, whatever. But it won't let us take it. Probably not the best idea right now. Hopefully at some point, frosty. something will come up. And it'll give us that option. Because the more people, the better. Especially capable people who seem trustworthy. He doesn't seem like he has any sort of qualms. He just wants to get along and live. Let's be ready to shoot. Nothing hiding in here. Huh. Just one more to check. Not ominous at all. I'd tap the door a couple times first so that... Well, I don't know. Do you want to get the attention if something's there? Nothing. Well, I shouldn't say nothing, but... That's the no last one. room. Looks like downstairs is secure. What about those boxes? I guess it's not important. Uh, please ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Not a problem. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. See? Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Alcohol. Uh, just dog food. And alcohol. And there's some whiskey in the back. Infection. I was just asking infection. Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? That was a little bit... I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine, honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. Don't be... Lee? Lee, you need to get up here now. What's wrong? Kenny? It's Kenny. I knew it. Where is he done? Is he on the roof? Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. I'm too scared to see what's happened. 
I didn't want to look I up. Can't get him to come down. What if I poke my head up, and the thing from Stay the grudge here. is there? Oh my god! Oh. Stupid Shaggy. Not good for anything. You should probably have your gun in hand, Lee. If we shoot Kenny, we shoot Kenny. It's worth it. We don't want to get killed by a zombie surprise attack. Yeah. Kenny. Uh, I've seen the light, Lee. There's only Kenny. one way. You okay, man? Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? Oh, my God. Uh... Kind of looks like duck, don't he? It's just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here. Starved to death. Jesus Christ. Wow. I don't know if I can, Lee. That could have happened Couldn't at Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. Kenny, man, we don't have to do this. Wait, right no, no. Maybe we should just get I'm out in, of here. I'm in Kenny Kenner, leave, and know? I'll take care of it while he's not watching. You want to just walk away? No. I don't know if I can do that either. I definitely think I should probably take care of it, but let's see, there's a door right there, there's Kenny right there, I can, I'm not giving him the gun, zombie over there, poor kid, must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death, oh, this could have been Clementine if I hadn't found her when I did, exactly, 